And having worked at Uber, having worked with Travis, knowing that Travis was on the board and in the room when all of this was happening, what do you make of this choice? I mean, I think it's a super exciting choice for the people that work at Uber, but I think it's going to be really challenging for Dara. Um, you know, there's, there's a company that's fiercely loyal to Travis and to Emil and to Ryan, to the leadership founders that are, you know, now leaving and are on their way out. And so he's got a lot of work to do ahead of him. He's got to convince 15,000 employees um, that he has their best interests at heart, and he's got to get them all playing for the front of the jersey. That's going to be pretty tough. Now, Dara Khosrowshahi, you know, I've interviewed him a couple times, but obviously this is someone that, you know, we're going to get to know over the years. I'm curious, Lane, why you think it's an exciting choice. I mean, we know his record at Expedia. We know he did uh, some big deals, including buying Home Away and buying Orbitz. We know he was the CFO at IIC for many years. Uber certainly does need some deep financial expertise. You know, what do you think he really brings to the table? You know, I've talked to a lot of former employees and current employees in the past 24 hours to get their reactions. And really, it seemed like everybody at the company wanted somebody who could help deal with some of the issues the company's been dealing with mm -hmm. over the past few months. Um, it, it's pretty clear that there was a strong desire for a female leader. Mm -hmm. But since that didn't happen, uh, I think they're pretty happy that there's um, an immigrant leader mm -hmm. who can probably best represent the interests of a uh, multicultural, diverse base of drivers and employees who are all over the world, and even communities that are very different um, from each other in different countries. So I think there's a lot of excitement. Lane, how do you imagine Dara is going to work with Travis and what Travis's involvement might be? Yeah, I think it's uh, you know probably too early to count Travis out. Uh, I suspect he's going to stay involved and probably significantly involved. Um, you know, if I was Dara, probably one of the first things I would do is build an alliance with Travis, um, get rid of you know kind of all the petty bickering on the board level, um, and then start focusing on how they're going to work together to make sure the day-to-day -day operations of the company are fluid uh, and that they set their sights on what's next. Hopefully, a big IPO.